Good morning, Corpus Christi. You are looking at a cloud free blue sky over downtown right now, and that's going to be the story for much of the day today. I tell you what that cloud free sky, the low winds, kind of a still morning out there allowed our temperatures to plummet overnight. Here's the current temperatures outside, and one thing I got to show you 69 degrees in Beeville. It's July in South Texas, and we're talking about 60s on the temperature map or 71. Right now in Corpus Christi, 70 in Robstown and Kingsville. Of course, along the coastline, we're just a little bit warmer up there in the mid to upper 70s. The daily lows for today, they're, we're pretty near where those low temperatures are at, but 68. That was the coolest we got in Beeville for this morning. 70 degrees in Corpus Christi, and that does break the low for the record low for today uh, that used to be 92 degrees set back in 1993. So believe it or not, we are getting very cool, and that's because the dew points have dropped so low. We've got much drier air in the region today than what we would typically have across the coastal bend, and when these dew points get into the upper 60s to close to 70, that's when we start to see those low temperatures nudging down just a little bit further. So we've also got some visibility concerns this morning. We've got some uh, fog in and around the Corpus Christi area for Robstown as well. Beeville has perfect visibility, so it's just kind of some patchy fog that's going to burn off though over the next couple of hours. Temperatures across the state. Most folks are in the 70s, a little bit cooler for a lot of folks, especially in Amarillo, where we're currently 65 degrees. As for high temperatures today, we're headed for 94 in Corpus Christi, 89 for Port Aransas and the upper 90s for some of our folks off to the north and west. Lower humidity though means a little bit lower heat index, so we're not going to see those heat index values getting quite as high as what we have for the past couple of days. So that seven day forecast, we've got 92 for Friday, 92 again on Saturday. Not much change till we get into the latter part of the weekend when the breezier conditions pick up. And then as we get into Tuesday, that's when we're throwing some isolated chances for showers in the forecast. I'll have more on that coming up next half hour right here on Action 10 News.